In our Wake Up India special today, Saina Nehwal talks exclusively to our editor for the South, T.S. Sudhir. She says she's focusing her attention on this year's Asian Games. Now, her coach, Pulela Gopichand, who joined the interview, says uh, Saina's win at the recent Indian Grand Prix brought him even more joy than the Padma Bhushan he was recently awarded. It was a double whammy for national badminton coach Pulela Gopichand just before Republic Day. The Padma Bhushan was announced for him and two of his best students, Saina and Sindhu, entered the finals of the India Grand Prix. Many congratulations, Gopi. Uh, your mom told me that you were more happy about Saina and Sindhu entering the finals than about the Padma Bhushan. Uh, well, I was, uh, during that time, um, uh, more involved in the match. So, uh, yes, I, I think uh, for me it was uh, very good matches which both of them pulled out. Both had tough semi-finals and I was uh, really very happy about that result. Uh, Saina, Gopi has always said that it is about Saina and Sindhu. It's not Saina versus Sindhu. Did his Padma Bhushan, the announcement, motivate you to give your best? Actually, um, you know, the way he works hard every day with us, he deserves all the awards. So, I think finally uh, this award was expected and, um, you know, finally getting it before the finals was really, I think, uh, you know, I think he was very happy with the way I pulled out my match. He actually told me uh, after that match, Saina, you are back. And um, immediately after that, I got to know. My father told me that Sir has got the Padma Bhushan. So I was very happy and uh, just uh, told him congratulations, Sir. And he was like, um, Saina, just go all out tomorrow and uh, play your best. I am very happy for both of you and I just want to see your match tomorrow. Although he didn't come for the match, but he was um, very happy for both of us. We both played finals. and. Um, I actually played one of my best matches in the final, so I was very happy for both the things that I won the uh, tournament and also that he got the award, so it was a great day for badminton. Gopi, you had said that when the two of them play, you will be nowhere near the stadium, but is it any different for you? Uh, are you more tense as to whether they will both follow all the directions that you have given them? Well, I think um, for me it was the easiest in the sense um, I, I don't. it doesn't really matter for me so much. Um, only if I watch, I'm watch, watching it from an academic interest in the sense who employs what strategies and just to see the play of tactics in their heads. Um, but uh, I think it's really good that uh, both of them, I spoke to both of them uh, through the same phone. I said, uh, um, I called up um, our physio Kiran, I said, you give the phone to Saina and then I spoke exactly the same words to Saina and he gave the phone to Sindhu and I f said the same thing to her. Um, I think what is very good um, is that yeah, both of them together as a team do well. Uh, both of them uh, together as a pair uh, start hunting uh, players, exchanging notes and uh, that is great. I think uh, Sindhu's, uh, Sindhu will help Saina and Saina of course definitely uh, is a great motivation for Sindhu and uh, both of them together uh, will be great for Indian badminton. Uh, Saina, this also ends the drought of titles. 2013 was not a year you would really like to remember. What went wrong last year and what is going right this year? Uh, Gopi said you are back. I think uh, I hurried up too much. Playing too many tournaments was a big uh, mistake which I did of course. Um, after the toe fracture which I got in uh, April, uh, after that the next three months was really bad. Um, then after that it was only losing 21-19 in the third set to all the top players. Um, I actually asked him most of the times, uh, what's going wrong, I'm not getting that one point and I think I'm really uh, low on my confidence. I was uh, really not getting into that uh, mode of winning any, any big match um, last year. So, you know, first thing he told me was, you just, um, you know, don't play one tournament, uh, let's just train for four weeks and um, we'll see how, how it really helps. So I opted out from Korea Open and uh, we started working a lot more on the, um, I think, fitness, which was really a big, um, you know, big issue for me last year. I was uh, not really good on court, I was not moving well. My movements were um, really slow. Um, I think that's the that's how my even my strokes were not really 100%. I think movements play a big role, and um, I had to really get back into the shape. I was uh, not 100% at all. Um, I think those four weeks before this. Okay, now you are feeling much better. Much better. The the uh, I think the way I moved in this tournament was really yes. good. Like how I was moving before. 
um, those four weeks, although it was not um, really enough time, but still I worked on a lot of areas. Um, Gopi sir actually made me work a lot. He said, um, you know, last one year was really bad for you, so I think you better first correct your, um, you know, fitness. And I think um, he really made a good plan for that, and it really worked very well within four weeks. Gopi, 2014 is going to be an extremely critical year. You're the Commonwealth, the Asian Games. What is it going to be? Um, there isn't much time. Is that the way you see it? Well, I think um, there is time enough, uh, to, uh, but there's no time to waste, and that's how I would put it. Uh, we need to be meticulous in the planning. Uh, we need to use the time very um, correctly, and we need to plan ourselves properly. We can't be emotional about it, and uh, we just need to work on areas which are important and uh, tournaments which are important. At the end of the year, when I look at it, it's a five important events. The All England is important. We have the Thomas Huber Cup, the World Championships, the Commonwealth and the Asian Games, these five events. And uh, I think if we have to let go of the rankings a bit, if we have to let go of any of the other things, I think it's uh, okay, but the focus should be on these big events. So it doesn't bother you that Sinai has now slipped to ninth? Rankings doesn't bother you? Well, it only has uh, certain advantages in terms of the draw, but um, uh, at the level where Saina is, and uh, uh, for her, um, nothing less than a win is a good performance. So at that stage, rankings really don't matter. I think it's what's important is good preparation, good frame of mind, and um, you being able to uh, get the results where it matters. Saina and Gopi, uh, it has been a fantastic start for you to 2014 and we hope that you continue with the same form and momentum. You have given us a lot of joy and we hope that you continue the same thing. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you.